my sunrise on the darkest day Got me feeling some kind of way Make me wanna savor every moment slowly Slowly Hi beauties, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I have a what's in my bag video and I'm so excited. These are my favorite videos to watch and I haven't done one in a while and I have a new bag that I just purchased. So to show you guys what I carry on like an everyday basis since I'm actually running out for lunch very soon and yeah, I have everything in there right now that I would usually have makeup, my wallet and just like random things, camera of course, so I just want to share everything with you. If you guys like watching videos like this, make sure to give this video a thumbs up. And of course, if you guys are not subscribed to my channel, make sure to subscribe now for weekly lifestyle decor and beauty videos. Also hit that little notification button so you guys get notified on my future videos. And if you guys are not following me on Snapchat, Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter, go add me now. <laughs> but yeah, without further ado, I am gonna get started with this video. If you guys follow me on Snapchat or Instagram, you would have already seen me post my new bag right here. So this is the LV Neverfull, and it's like the limited edition one with all of the pink LV um, logo on it and it honestly I've seen it in photos but it's so different looking in person it was so beautiful when I saw it in person and also it was their last one so I was like oh I have to get it um, but yeah pretty much it is a massive massive bag and the one thing that I really love about it I like carrying it this way but you guys can actually adjust the bag so if you guys take that out you guys can wear it this way as well, which it's like the very large tote bag. Zipper on the inside as well. So in that little zipper, uh, there I actually found the coin purse for the bag that I have, the ballerina print, and it's so pretty. Like I absolutely love it and they're so hard to find. And I think I've only seen this and then the wallet, but I already have the wallet in the multicolor, so I didn't need two wallets, but I ended up getting the little coin purse. And of course it's the one that has uh, the chain right here so it's really nice to have you can put your keys on this if you wanted to and just carry around your coins in here and then you can also place like a few cards in here which I really like too the other thing that I carry with me of course is my camera you guys know I carry this everywhere just in case I'm vlogging and I actually have the Samsung NX1 mini so it's the pink one and it's like the flip screen so it's really great for vlogging if you guys vlog and it's easy to like see yourself and take photos selfies or whatnot so I really like this camera and it's the light pink one. I'll leave the Amazon link down below which is where I bought it off. And the other thing of course I always have headphones on me just in case I want to listen to music. And I'm going to go through this bad boy right here. This is my Princess Vibes makeup bag. A lot of stuff in here so I'm just going to go through everything. And um, it was actually for the stuff that I had during the photo shoot. It was for touch ups. Um, so there is quite a bit of makeup in here and I'm just going to go through it all. And the first thing I have right here is the Tatcha Luminous Dewy Skin Mist. You guys know this is like my absolute favorite skin mist mist of life like I love this stuff I take it everywhere with me and it's so hydrating if your skin is feeling a little dull or dry it just makes your skin glowy fresh and feel amazing as well so I mean I love it I'll do a little spritz spritz right now and it smells so fresh and it's just so lightweight which I really like about it and I mean I do have the fix plus as well but the only thing I find about the fix plus it is really wet um, so I like that this one's a little bit lighter weight and then everything else in here. So I've got my Unicorn Love brush, and this is like the perfect touch-up brush. It's the one that is tapered at the end right here. So what I like using this for is right underneath the eyes, and it's just like the perfect touch-up brush. And I always use my Airbrush Flawless Face Finish Powder. <laughs> and this is my third one. Like, I love this powder. It is amazing. It's just translucent, so I just use a little bit of that and apply it straight onto the face. And I usually get in the inner corners of my nose, too, because I get oily. Um, but yeah, it's a beautiful touch-up brush and I love it and then the other uh, Product that I have in here is my Too Faced bronzer and this is a must This is the Too Faced dark chocolate and because I'm a little tanned right now, which is good So I like using the dark one right here and it smells like chocolate. It is a beautiful bronzer I'm wearing it today very natural and I love it Just putting everything to the side so I don't show you guys anything twice um, Also, I was using the Mac Mariah Carey collection eyeshadow palette for the photo shoot so I mean I love this palette it's gorgeous I just like a very nice smoky eye palette and I mean you don't carry that around in your makeup bag every day um, but it's nice if you were creating like a look or changing up your look from day to night you could smoke it out a little bit the other thing I have right here is the Aloha Hawaii coconut um, it's just a little hand sanitizer that I picked up when I was in Hawaii so I always carry that around with me and then the other thing of course lash glue gotta have lash glue just in case your lash um, is having a bad day because the wind I always carry it with me 
Uh, right here I've got the Jouer, this is in the color Buff, and it's like such a nice natural peachy color, very nice natural every day. It's very matte, so it stays on all day. I usually top it off with some gloss because I like glossy finish. Um, and speaking of that, this topper by Stila, this is the Glitterati Lip Top Coat, and it's amazing. It's so glittery and so sparkly, so if you guys like sparkles and glitter, you're going to love this. And it's also really lightweight, like it's not, um, you can't really feel it on your lips, which I like. And I just paired it up with Angel today, which is the lipstick I'm wearing right now by MAC. You know, it's my favorite. I didn't even know there was this much makeup in here. It's so crazy. Okay, so the other brush I have right here is my Angled Blush, and it's the Mermaid Collection. So, of course, if you're doing a touch-up throughout the day, just a little bit of blush. Perfect blusher brush. And, of course, I've been carrying this one, which is the Baby Love, and it's the Too Faced one. Oh, my goodness. I had been using the pink one. This one is so much more natural looking on my skin, and it's, like, peachy, bronzy almost, like, in between, and it's just a gorgeous color. I definitely have to buy this in the full size because I just have the small one, and it's so pretty. Um, and then, also, I've got right here this the Becca Shimmering Skin Perfector in Champagne Splits, and I love champagne. I love Champagne Pop as a highlighter, and then also um, this I like because it has a blush. It has the duo, so it has the highlighter and blush, and they're both gorgeous colors. Very um, pigmented, super pigmented, so you don't have to use a lot, which I like about it. And then also I've got a concealer brush in here that I use just in case I have to touch up right underneath my eyes. This is the concealer T14 from the Teal Brush Book. And then ba -ba, another brush I have right here, this is the Unicorn Highlight Brush right here. So I mean a little bit of highlight throughout the day. I like to take it down the nose, cheekbones, Cupid's bow. I use this and then I usually just go in with a Champagne Pop, this one right here. And then also concealer. This one is really nice, a touch up one throughout the day. It's the NARS uh, Pore Perfecting, is it? Soft Matte Complete Concealer. That is what it's called. This is what it looks like, and it's just really nice to wear underneath the eyes. Or also, if you're fixing up liner, it's really nice to fix it up. Also, right underneath the brow bone as well for more shape. I use that as well for that. And then, speaking of brows, I use Gimme Brow, and there's like no more writing on it. That's how long I've been using it for. But I comb it through my brows just to give it a little bit more color and also to make my hairs stay up because they always like to go down for some reason. So. Um, and then I also have my brow spoolie right here just in case I have to fix my brows throughout the day because my brow hairs like to go down like I said and then uh, what do I have in here and also I have an eyeliner so this is the Marc Jacobs um, eyeliner right here and it's the one where it's just like the twisty which I like I like that you don't have to sharpen them it makes things easier and it's a gel one so I usually put this one smoke it out on the top of my lash line I don't really put it on the bottom because I find it can leak a little bit um, but yeah that is everything. I literally went through everything in my makeup bag. This is from my friend Tiffany, and she's actually one of my bridesmaids, and she got this made for me when she went to Japan, which was so sweet. And it's like my favorite color pink. She had engraved back here, SL Miss Glam, which is so cute. And then just inside, I've been putting my cards, cash, and it's just nice to kind of like travel with. It's just small like that, petite. And it's just like a nice little wallet. And then the other thing here that actually came with the bag, and I wanted to show you guys this, is the makeup bag. So you guys can put whatever you want in here, um, especially for your if you're traveling, like it's a lot easier to travel with, I find. Um, if you have something like this, you could use it for whatever, um, putting your passports in um, or whatnot, but I love the fact that it came with this. And of course, you can unclip it off the bag as well. So I believe in every single never full bag, you get like the little bag, like this included, which I love. Um, because something like this at LV would be really costly anyways if you were to buy it by itself because I know my change purse I think was like 450 for that little thing so it was nice that this came with it that was another perk on why I got this bag and the last thing that I would have in my bag is obviously my phone um, so I carry that with me at all times and that is pretty much everything that I carry in my bag so I mean I've seen a lot of these and people have like a ton of stuff in their bags I honestly don't carry too much I don't like having like a super heavy bag um, so yeah that's honestly everything that I carry in my bag with me I'd love to know what you guys have in your bags though on a daily basis so let me know leave down in the comments what bags you're using I would love to know and I hope you guys enjoyed seeing that I always know it's fun seeing kind of what people carry around um, so yeah I mean if I'm going to a lunch or a dinner that is usually typically what I'll have in my bag. So you guys would have seen this in my last bag video. I thought I'd show you guys anyways. I don't use it every day um, just because it's such a keepsake. So I was using the other one my friend Tiffany got me. But this one is honestly gorgeous as well. It's like one of my favorite, favorite wallets. And I had my name like engraved on here as well. Um, they do that at LV, which I really like. And it's just like one of my favorite wallets. So um, I'm crazy when it comes to like keeping nice things intact and like 
perfect so I mean I don't like using it all the time do change up my wallets as much as I can usually uh, depending on the bag that I'm bringing um, if I'm using my little pink bag right over there I usually bring this wallet with it um, but yeah since I was just traveling I was using the little SM is glam one that my friend got me I thought it was super cute to travel with I put my passport in there as well and speaking of passports I just wanted to show you guys these again I'm sure you've seen them in one of my videos before this was made by my good friend Louise and she's also a subscriber of mine super sweet and she actually made these for me and I do travel with them all all the time um, I've just been using them so much as decor and I swear I'm gonna like definitely display these in my new beauty room and I'm so excited so I love them so so much so I wanted to show you guys these as well and then on the inside here I put my passport you can put receipts and it's just so easy that I also put my cards in here when I was traveling and I love it like it's definitely one of my favorites and you guys see me do nail shots with it all the time because it's so custom it's so me so I love it anyways that was everything in my bag guys so I really hope you guys enjoyed watching it everything will be linked down below for you guys if you are interested in anything um, if you have any questions leave questions down below and also if you guys like seeing these types of videos let me know because I do have some other bags um, and I style different things with them so I mean everything would kind of be different on what I put in that bag so let me know um, in the comments down below and if you guys are not following me on all my social medias make sure to do that I have giveaways all the time on there especially my snapchat so make sure to go add me on there and it's just SL Miss Glam if you guys wanted to add me and yeah I will see you guys in my next video thank you guys so much for watching Bye.